channel. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. This is going to be your read for Tuesday, okay? I just finished recording the read for Monday, October the 2nd, and um, I'm very excited about that energy, okay? Um, so anyway, uh, enough about that. Let's go ahead and get into it for this Tuesday, okay? We're going to start this thing off with our We Not Doing That. We are royalty deck. Okay, and we're going to check out each element and see what message spirit has for each element. Okay, we're going to start it off with the air element. All right, what's going on in your thoughts? What are people maybe talking or speaking? What are you thinking of talking or speaking? This has to do with all things communication. Okay, air sign energy. All right, this is going to be the first part of your read. You guys, if you are new to the channel, welcome in, okay? I hope you guys make yourselves comfortable here. And if you guys are returning, welcome back, all right? Thank you guys so much to all of you all that have hit that like button, shared this content or any of my content, okay? And supported the channel in any type of way, you guys. Um, just so you know, I do have a Patreon channel, okay, where you have some different tiers, different options over there. You guys can check that out. I'll be sure to drop the link in the description box below. All right, let's get it. Thank you, angels and spirit guides, for clearing precise messages. Most high, what is the message next Tuesday? As today, you guys, it's Sunday that I'm recording this reading. Okay, let's get it. Tuesday, Holy Spirit, God says you are ready. Okay, we have the Ten of Swords, okay? That's completion, okay? And we have Lover's Energy. Ten Swords, we got the Eye of Ra is significant, okay? So it's something that is like um, with your sight, okay? Your, your spiritual sight. For those of you all that are seers, a lot of people could be talking about your spiritual gift of sight, okay? Um, or your spiritual gift of prophecy, okay? Your prophetic energy, all right? Your ability to see or know things in advance, okay? Um, something about a Gemini can be very significant, okay? I feel like a lot going on in the mind, but I feel like whatever was um, maybe tormenting you in the mind or uh, maybe if you were having some crazy thoughts, dreams, um, any of that, you guys, that's coming to an end, okay? So... We're laying that to rest on today, okay, you guys? I feel like let's go ahead and have the ceremony right quick, all right? We are gathered here today, okay? We're going to lay that energy to rest, all right? It's over. It's complete. It's done. It's been finalized, okay? Things could have ended as well with some form of a karmic lover, okay? I am seeing that as well. Ten swords, lovers. I feel like you are moving on a vision that you have seen or been given, okay? I'm hearing, I keep hearing the word provision, all right? Let me look it up because I keep hearing it and I didn't say it the first time I heard it. 11.46 on the clock, provision. What is provisions? Air signs, what is provision? Air signs, recently you guys could have gone through some form of a separation or detachment. Okay, I feel like this was for the better. All right, it's like now you're you're in you're in flow. Okay, you're in divine union, and I'm not talking about with another person, but this is like in tandem with the Lord. Okay, it's like you're aligned now. Provision, it means the action of providing or supplying something for use. New contracts for the provision of services. Number two says an amount or things supplied or provided. Low levels of social provision. Okay, so provision is something that's being provided or supplied for something. I'm um, supplying something for use. Okay, all right. Hmm. Provision. So there are some type of provisions being made for you or on your behalf, air signs, or maybe you're thinking about um, finding a way to make this provision, you know, for yourself. All right. Oh, these cards. Hold up. They doing the most. They're doing the most here. Let's see if we can get a good little shuffle on these cards. 
earth energy. Let's see what's moving and shaking on the ground for the element of earth and the earth signs. What is the happening? Earth's energy. What's going on, earth signs? Thank you, angels and spirit guides, for clear precise messages. Most high, thank you for using me as a vessel to give messages to your people. What is it that we need to be telling them here? Oh, I'm seeing congratulations. I'm seeing job well done. I'm hearing that song. Congratulations. <laughs> we made it. Is that Post Malone? I think. Okay, check that song out. All right. Earth Science. Yeah, we made it. Okay, we got the two of pentacles. Okay, and we have the world. All right, y'all are leaving something behind. Okay. You're like, I'm done with that. Okay. No more indecisiveness. That cycle is, is out of there. No more being juggled. No more being mishandled. Okay, you're free from that. No more people underestimating you. That's dead. Okay. Okay, there could have been some illusion that was surrendered. Okay. You surrendered an illusion. Okay. Something about an attack. All right. Oh, we're not doing that. Okay. We are royalty. All right. All right, this is for the element of fire, okay? Fire element. Thank you, angels and spirit guides. Show us what's, what is coming to light, what's being revealed, what's being highlighted at this time about my fire signs and my collective. Fire energy. Fire. Y'all been working hard, huh? Is that why God says y'all are ready? Y'all made it? You guys are, y'all are walking through a new season. This is a new chapter energy. This is new flow energy. Okay, we got the Knight of Wands. Okay, and we have the Five of Wands. Okay, so you guys could have been under some type of battle, uh, competition. Somebody could have been secretly competing with you. Okay, I feel like that's what's coming to an end here. You could have had a lover competing with you, okay? Competing for a position, competing for space in your life, competing with you because you're a warrior. What in the world? What's wrong with these people? I don't want to know. No, I don't mean literally spirit. You don't have to answer that. <laughs> You don't have to answer that. Okay, let's see what, what we feeling on an emotional level about all this. Okay, so fire signs, y'all are battling. Okay, you guys are battling some form of conflict. Okay, some type of, I'm hearing spiritual warfare. So you guys could have been experiencing some type of spiritual warfare. You guys can be closing the cycle to this spiritual warfare or to this competition or moving away from a lover that could have been putting you in some type of battle you could be telling this person hey i'm good on you ah uh -uh. lose my number okay don't call me no more all right don't come for me unless i send for you okay you could be on that type of time okay what do we got here we got chariot all right yeah y'all moving somewhere okay two of cups y'all moving on emotionally you guys have moved on and this was good for you. This actually was victorious energy for you guys. You guys have emotionally moved on from some type of uh, attack, okay? That could have been brought on to you by a lover, okay? Or an ex-lover. Somebody you ended it with with the Ten of Swords, all right? My nose is itching. Okay? So in this new cycle, there's a new partnership here for you, okay? This new partnership, this new connection that you're going to make, it's like, it's a victorious one. This is you in a position of victory. This is you also in control, okay? You guys are in the chariot. Y'all, it's like the sky is the limit now, okay? Now that you've gained your freedom, the sky is the limit here, okay? On an emotional side, I feel like y'all let go of something that it has something to do with this ex-lover that had your, you emotionally wrapped up, okay? Or emotionally stuck. All right, but now y'all are like out of there. You like, uh-uh. You guys have severed ties, like good riddance. Okay, y'all. I don't blame you guys. I don't blame you guys at all. So let me go ahead and clear this board, you guys. I will catch you guys on the second part of the reading. All right, loves. Welcome back. Let's go ahead and get into it. 
<sighs> so God says you are ready, okay? And I feel like you're ready because you freed yourself from emotions. You released yourself from, from some, some energy, okay? And that energy, I don't feel like was all the way right because it had you in competition. It had you battling, okay? And we ain't doing that, okay? We are royalty over here. Yeah, it had you trying to protect your damn energy. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so it says, God says you are ready. You guys, welcome in to the channel. Happy Tuesday, okay? Um, The part of your energy that didn't want you to proceed or go any higher, that's dead. Oh, oh, well, that makes sense, okay? All right, so y'all could have freed yourselves from you, okay? Um, but it's a vibe. Um, Archangel Michael's energy. No, yes, both. It's Archangel Michael and Archangel Gabriel's energy that is surrounding you at this time. Okay. You guys could have been seeing a lot of white orbs. That is Archangel Gabriel's energy. Okay. And blue orbs. That's Archangel Michael's energy. All right. We got Aphrodite, eternal love. Y'all done overcame a major obstacle in your life. You guys have done some, some serious reflecting here. Aphrodite in this car, she's holding both a pomegranate and a mirror, okay? I feel like your, your ability to reflect is what allowed you to be able to overcome, okay? You guys are overcomers here. I'm seeing that energy very strongly, okay? We got Kali Mai, spiritual transformation, okay? Y'all done, done like went through a makeover. You guys done transformed yourselves over here, okay? So, good news. Fast communication is on the way. Hashtag self-worth is significant, okay? We got Leah, stand your ground, okay? Stand your ground, all right? Um, your crown has been readjusted and your light has been recharged. There's a Six of Wands energy that is floating around as well. And um, this is letting me know, you guys, when I see this Six of Wands, it's going to let me know that there has been a heckler that's been removed, okay? This heckler is mad at you. They're mad at you because you didn't want to link up or work with them, okay? It could have been that Gemini or it could have been that lover energy or it's just signifying somebody that wanted to partner with you that you ended ended it with, okay? It doesn't have to be um, romantic. This could be platonic. This could be somebody that was maybe interested in working with you on a career inner, inner, or level, okay? Um, maybe they came in riding in like, yeah, I think we'd be great teammates. And I feel like you were shown otherwise by the divine, okay? And it kind of pissed this person off, okay? Um, there's something very significant as well about a butterfly tattoo, okay? All right. Yes, I seen you. I seen you in my dream, honey. Okay, I seen you. All right. <laughs> God's going to allow you to see someone. He's going to show you them. Okay. Uh, we have Baba Yaga with patience. All right. Well, Spirit, let it go a little long today because usually I only do about three. Uh, but Spirit was like, keep pulling. So here we are. Okay. Let's talk about it. The number five could be very significant. Five, five, five. You guys could have been seeing a lot of fives. Okay. So this heckler has been removed. And they threw a little bit of a fit on the way out. Okay. But y'all, y'all, we royalty over here. Okay. This channel is for the spiritually rich AF. All right. And we not doing that. Okay. We didn't do it yesterday. We don't see it happening tomorrow. We ain't doing it today. Okay. So Whatever the energy was that was mad, they had to get glad in them same draws they had on, okay? <laughs> anyway, let's see. Aphrodite, what signs for Tuesday are significant? Eternal love. So you guys have tapped into this goddess energy, all right? Y'all are here for it. The color pink is very significant as well. I'm seeing that. Okay. We got Pisces and Sagittarius. Okay. So we got Pisces, sensitized, eternal love. Okay, you guys are awakening the goddess inside. Okay, the goddess within, all right, is awakening. All right, no more high, no more lying dormant, no more um, dimming the light, no more none of that. Okay, y'all out here expanding full fledged Sagittarius energy, spiritual transformation. That's why I say y'all showing up new. Okay, you guys are showing up like y'all done went and had a makeover done. Okay. All right, so stand your ground. Leah, what's up? Leah, what do you have for us? 
y'all, y'all was thugging it out too. I see you. I see you. <laughs> I see you. Okay, Scorpio, y'all was thugging it out. Y'all was like, I am not going down. I don't care what y'all say, what y'all do. I'm not going anywhere. I can't be broken. Okay. Um, yeah, you can't be broken. You guys are unbreakable and you guys are unstoppable. Okay, Scorpio, investigate. All right, stand your ground. Somebody could have been spying on you or they could have sent an energy to you to find out information. Y'all, I've seen this energy in my energy so many times, okay? And every time they'd be on some messy stuff. So it's somebody that was sent to you to be on some messy stuff, okay? I feel like they got what they was looking for, okay? But it wasn't what they expected, all right? Maulisa Lisa with balance. These scales then got balanced out. So you guys got good news coming towards you. Okay, this is going to happen fast as well. All right, as we enter this season of Libra, happy birthday to any of my Libras that are in here. Y'all, I'm a Libra moon, so I love me some Libra energy. I love Libras. Okay, oh, Fucus, hold on, I fell on the floor. Divine Warriors, yeah, this, this, the scales is being balanced out for y'all, Warriors. Okay. Because they didn't have no business sending nobody to you. And the person that was sent didn't have no business coming, okay? What well, we said in the beginning of the reading, don't come for me unless I send for you. You didn't send for this energy, okay? So it's okay because at the end of the day, anytime energy comes to you, again, to compete or not, even if they come to evolve, they get what they're looking for, okay? Now, some of them may become triggered. But that's not for you to worry about. You're a catalyst for change. So you're just doing what you do. You're doing your job. Okay. Um, and it's a vibe where the ones that come to compete, they end up getting better. But guess who else does, y'all? Guess. Don't worry. I'll wait. Mm -hmm. It's you. You guys get better. Every time there's a spiritual attack sent to you guys and you guys overcome that spiritual attack, you guys get stronger and mightier and better and you guys evolve and you guys improve and you guys become man the shit okay <laughs> so it's that type of vibe this is why god is saying that you're ready okay thank your enemies at this time thank those that have been coming for you okay even though you didn't send for them because guess what they did they just made you more prepared so that when god says you are ready you are really ready okay it was all part of his plan i know you're probably like what it was a part of God's plan to allow me to be attacked. Yes, because he already knew, just like Job, he already knew that you would survive the attack, okay? So it's that vibe. Hold on, y'all. Another card fall on the floor. Oh, Capricorn, Cathar, soul, family, achieve. He already knew that you would survive. He already knew that you would achieve and accomplish greatness, okay? He already knew that. That's why he allowed the attacks to come, just like with Job. He allowed Job to be under attack. Okay, because he knew that Job would never denounce him. Okay, he knew that Job would never turn away from God. Okay, so I feel like whoever was trying to attack you, their intent was to get you to turn away from God or get you to feel like God had turned away from you. We royalty over here, y'all. Okay, Libra energy. You see them scales balanced out, Libra. We ain't playing them type of games. We are not on that type of time. Okay, so that's okay. That's okay. It works out in everybody's favor, including the opposition, including the energy that was sent to attack you, okay? So here we are. Baba Yaga, got your ancestors here. They like, don't worry about none of this, okay? This was all meant to balance you out. It was all meant to prepare you, to equip you, to build you up, to strengthen you, okay? So as long as you have that type of a mindset, you guys, when we are under attack and we are experiencing people who are speaking out negatively on us or trying to come for us or whatever the case is, just remain in the energy of the fact that you're not hurting me. They're not hurting you. They're only making you better. Okay, so let them continue to add to mm -hmm, them, 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 how they say April showers bring May flowers. Continue to let them add to them April showers, okay? Because you're about to receive your May flowers, even though we in the fall, okay? Fall equinox, by the way, that just occurred yesterday. We're in the energy of it right now, okay. Yesterday was the 23rd, okay? So anyway, for you all, it's not though. But back to the message, okay? Let's go ahead and get us a few affirmations. Y'all know I love to dote on us, okay? It feels good when you get some compliments, y'all. We already figured this out. So let me just boost you up. Let me lift your spirits right quick, okay? It says, I am an original, okay? Throwback 
Thursday. But something about Throwback Thursday is actually Throwback Tuesday on today. Okay, love you so much. All right, pink flowers could be very significant. I'm going to speak about those in a later reading. Um, and we have Happy Thursday and Lavender. You guys, this Thursday, you may want to take some time out, okay? Um, this is like spa day energy, okay, Pisces? You may want to look into getting a spa day for Thursday or taking a little time out, okay? Um, we got Powerful Hand of God. I'm a mogul, okay? Sagittarius, Powerful Hand of God. Happy Friday, all right? Sag, you got this Six of Wands energy here. We got five on the candelabra and one in between these pumpkins, Okay, y'all, it is the fall. It's fall, y'all. Okay, so we got our pumpkin energy down there. Okay, um, but there is a ghost here. Your energy, because you are this mogul, okay, you done scared this ghost away. Okay, you like a ghost buster, all right, in, in rare form. Okay, in <laughs> Sagittarius. All right, let's see. So you guys are original and you guys are moguls. Okay, what about my Scorpio? What's the affirmation? Ooh, Scorpio, something about $500. What about my $500? Okay, I'm getting that off the movie Django. You guys could have recently watched Django, or that could be a movie recommendation for you guys um, on Tuesday. Okay, so what's going on for Scorpio? Let me dote on my Scorpios. What does God affirm about Scorpio? Oh, I love when the cards jump out like that. Scorpio, they saying, I am motherfucking right, Okay. El Chapo energy. You guys are El Chapo Jr. All right. We got um uh, the energy here of October. Okay. So we all we all here. Okay. Dia de los Muertes. Okay. Could be very significant to you, Scorpio. You could be celebrating your ancestors during this time. Um, but you have the sword. Okay, man. So you actually have this ability, you all, whether you're Scorpio or not, and you guys are resonating. Um, also, thank you so much for hitting that like button. But you guys um have this energy where with this sword, you guys can cut yourselves free from anything, okay? Look, I am the plug. Oh, Fugus, don't play with you, okay? Don't play with, don't play with it, don't play with it, don't play with it. Oh, Fugus, Divine Warriors, have a nice day. I am the plug. Wednesday, okay, uh, oh, Fugus will be very significant for you. Scorpio, it looks like Thursday will be very significant for you and Sagittarius Friday will be significant for you. Okay. What else? What do we got for Capricorn, Holy Spirit? What's the affirmation? What are you affirming about my Capricorns? Yes, we doting on your kids today. What are we affirming about your Capricorns? What's the affirmation? Thank you, Holy Spirit. Capricorn, y'all got it going on. Yep, y'all got it going on. Okay, Electric Feminine. I'm a status symbol okay life experiences seizing your uniqueness oh, goddess energy let me tell you something this right here this one affirmation sums it up for the whole group okay the fact that it says life experiences seizing your uniqueness okay everything you guys that you have been through it has added to who you who you are, okay? All right? With all this energy you guys got out here, Libra, what's at the bottom of the deck for you, sweetheart? I am an ascended master, okay? Live life surrounded by quality, premium quality. You guys are five-star energy because I'm a five-star chick because I'm a five-star. You know I'm a five-star. Okay, sorry, y'all. Shout out to the artist that made that song. But anyway, because I don't know who it is right now. But you guys are tapped in, okay? Libra to this tree of life energy, okay? You guys are tapped into your energy of the ancestors as well. Very, very potent. Very, very strong, okay? Um, now, everything you built went through has built you, okay? Let's go ahead and get an overall energy from our spiritually rich AF deck. Y'all got the presence of angels around you. Y'all shedding some dead weight. You guys are moving forward. Y'all looking good while you're doing it. Y'all out here original moguls. Y'all are right. That means accuracy. Y'all carrying the sword. Y'all are the plug. Okay. You guys are seen as a status symbol. And you guys are ascended masters. Come on now. It can't get no better than that. It can't get no better than that. This lets me know you guys are on your job. Y'all are on your purpose. You guys are on assignment. You guys are on your duty. Y'all are handling the biz naive. Okay. All right, let's get a card from the Spiritually Rich AF. What's an overall energy for this read? Holy Spirit, show us clearly. Thank you. And please. <laughs> God says you guys are ready. 
This energy straight up says ready. Okay, ready. Ready, Freddy. Somebody's name could be Freddy. Oh, y'all been free from some type of an illusion. I feel like, ugh, yes, it's good. Y'all don't let y'all hair down. Y'all got this makeover. Some of you guys are physically getting makeovers. You guys are looking really good, okay? Um, so 20, excuse me, 222. Two, two. Hashtag 222 two, two is very significant. Check out the um, angel number two. Um, two, 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 three twos. Okay. Spiritual bath. You guys, that is the recommendation for this reading. Y'all get in there and take your spiritual bath. Okay. This could be a really good time as well for you all to meditate outdoors. We got nine, nine, nine. Okay. It's a new cycle getting ready to begin for us. Okay. So I feel like let's just get a tea right quick. We're going to pull, um, a short and sweet. I feel like I just needed to just dote on y'all. God is like, I, he, you just needed to jump in here and affirm to these people that God says that y'all are ready. Okay? Y'all are ready. Your ancestors are like, yeah, they ready. Okay? Your soul tribe, your soul family was like, yeah, they ready. Okay? Them scales is balanced out. They done stood their ground. Okay? They're immovable. Just like Job. They can't be, they can't be, they can't be moved, okay? They can't be changed. What's tea for this reading, Holy Spirit? What's tea overall for this reading? stack spirit <laughs> not that whole stack one to come out that's too many cards something about barbecue oh okay i'm gonna take this one okay these right here i'm gonna put back all right let's see what this says okay it's the jacksons enjoy yourself okay love is real all right tours could be significant okay we got classic new communication okay um made by a woman all right look out for some communication made by a woman okay it's going to be considered classic all right oh hmm enjoy yourself this is the vibe this is by the jacksons you guys check out this song okay that's going to be your tea for this reading Okay, and the other one at the bottom of the deck, we got OMG Libra. Okay, y'all can't really see Libra, it's in black, but you can see the A. Someone's initial um, name could start with an A. But anyway, this says, uh, and somebody's trying to pull a publicity stunt. Okay, I'm, that card is behind this. But anyway, it says, uh, we set the trends. Okay, um, mushrooms could be significant or polka dots. Y'all, I've seen these polka dots, but it put me in the mind of uh, mini mouse. Okay. Mini mouse. All right. Something is significant there, but anyway, there's a surprise coming in. Okay. The divine has a surprise for you. All right. And, um, yeah, y'all check out this song. Okay. These two songs are your tea for this reading. Let's go ahead and pull a buzz on it. You guys, and I'm going to let you guys go. God says you're ready. So you guys says y'all ready for this surprise that's coming in. Okay. Y'all be patient with yourselves. Be patient as well as these scales balance out. Okay. As above, so below. So we got good news coming to you. This good news is a surprise. Okay. It's going to have you, your, like, if your confidence already on a team, you, your confidence about to be on a hundred, a thousand, hell, I don't know. But something like that, okay? Something's going to really boost your confidence, okay? We got love out of this nebula. Ooh, I like it. What's at the bottom of the deck? Trust the process. Okay, I'm here for it, spirit. Y'all, this has been your read. I hope that you guys enjoyed. Happy Tuesday to you guys. And I'll see you guys um in the Wednesday's read. Bye, loves.